All right, so this week's book was Burn the Business Plan, What Great Entrepreneurs Really Do, and it's by Carl J. Schwamm, former president of the Ewing Marion Kaufman Foundation. All right, so this book is basically from entrepreneurs. It basically tells you how it really is to be an entrepreneur, and what the book mainly consists of is just a whole bunch of stories from um, other startup businesses. It talks about like Mark Zuckerberg and how he started up his business, and it basically tells you that everything that you learn and like school and college is basically wrong and how you shouldn't take the traditional approach and how there's not one basic outline for entrepreneurs it's not something that you can really learn you have to do it so it has a lot of examples on how you can um just take charge and become a great entrepreneur and you guys should really check this one out it's actually a really good book but yeah burn the business plan y'all check it out next week is you are a badass at making money i started reading it so far and i'm low-key gonna finish it before next week but this book this is Funny. Y'all need to read this book too. But yeah, I'll, I'll tell y'all about this one when it's done. When it comes to this hip hop music, you lose it. Sell it. Kick back, you know the pimp back. Ain't no slip back. Moving inside the movement, you not with it. Better get back. Nigga, I'm fresh as Kit Tat. On the way to see why's the case perform. The new go. They go by the name of Wazi Queso, right? Wazi Queso. There we go. Wazi Queso. I need y'all to give it up for Wazi Queso. How y'all doing? Thank y'all for coming out, showing love. It's our first uh, Speak Easy. Me and him just released the tape two months for last month called Wazi Queso. It's on Apple Music. Yeah, shout out to y'all for listening to it. But uh, Wazi Queso, my title, Apple Music and Spotify. It's W A A S I K E S O. Wazi Queso is on most major streaming platforms and stuff. My name is Jiggy Queso. I'm from New York. I'm from Queens. I moved down here. Um, I go to FAU. I met this dude. This is my boy now. Oh, that's okay. Yeah, yeah. All right. Before we drop some, I just want to say that we are young, gifted, black, and misrepresented. So hated by the nation, but we bottle our frustration. Cause we always seem to hate when we tell them that we gave them shit. Our music food and even some of our relationships. So instead of these enough, you go take this shit. Cause all my niggas had enough. All that racist shit. We just pray you back away with all that basic shit. Why is he queso? The real one never faked this shit. Appreciate it, Shaq. Yeah. This is a song for everybody who got somebody that they lost. Let's roll out. Damn. Think about niggas who didn't make it. All of my niggas, I see their faces. Can't even show congratulations. Can't even show the vision I miss on my niggas and know I cannot replace it. Need me the money, I stay chasing. I never need a vacation. Crazy these niggas be enemies. Acting like they was a friend of me. Good late morning, YouTube. Uh, right now, it's about like 11 o'clock. I kind of woke up late, but eh, it is what it is. I just gotta do better tomorrow. But yeah, right now I'm on the way to City Hall because what I'm trying to do now is find some more money that I can use towards a, a multiplex. And basically what a multiplex is, for those of you do, who don't know, it's like, an, um, it's like four apartments pushed into one. 
eh, it's kind of a bad way to explain it. But yeah, it's like four apartments and they're each like connected, but each of them are their own separate apartments. So I'm trying to get enough money and save up and um, ask for grants so I can be able to buy like one entire multiplex. So that's like one of my goals right now. I feel like if I could do that, then I could, um, I feel like that's just another source of income. I don't know if I was talking to you guys in the other video about making more sources of income. But yeah, that's one of the things I'm trying to do right now. So yeah, I'm driving towards City Hall right now. I'm trying to get that taken care of. I feel like today's supposed to be a long day, but who knows. Alright, so I just left the Boca Raton City Hall, and they didn't have what I was looking for. So right now I'm on the way to Pompano's City Hall, and I feel like they might have what I want just because the um, underdeveloped community, or it's more undeveloped than um, Boca is. So yeah, hopefully they have it. I'm not I'm not sure to be quite honest with you, but yeah, we better find out right now. Each City Hall that I go to is teaching me a little bit more, I feel like, or it's going to teach me a little bit more than the last one. So yeah, we'll see. Alright, so I just went to the um, second town hall or city hall, and I got the, is this a, that's kind of funny. Yeah, I just got the information that I needed, and I think I'll be good to go. I'm just like focusing on that stuff right now, and I'm in the shop, just putting in some hours, and setting up for the um, Eda Arts event that's going to go on here called Dope Paints. It's kind of like painting with a twist, but on the go. Yeah, shout out to Dory. So yeah, that's going on. We just finished setting up getting some tablecloths and some wine just to fill it out right now but yeah making some moves for today all right so i'm finished working at the shop and i'm um, I'm home for the day and like right now this is our patio pretty big got a lot of space and what i'm thinking of doing is like closing this off with cardboard and doing like a studio out here and jesse wants to close this off with a backdrop and make it like a photo studio so yeah. ultimately it'll be like half regular studio and half like photo studio so those are our plans for like setting up out here but yeah it was like a, how it looks and we're thinking about using these cardboards right here and open it up yeah insulation so yeah we look what's good about to go pick up some food from walmart with devin and um jesse right now rocking a little ml custom made shirt with the ml hat what? Why do you got three MLs on? What's the third one? Ha! Major look, nigga! Yeah, shade in the back. One half of Wazzy case. Hey, bro, just, um... Ask him where you are. Where are you? Just picked up our food. Had self pickup at Walmart, just got our food. Best to be on the way back to the crib. It was a struggle, but we got it done, goddamn. True. Yeah, so we got I just got back home from Walmart and set up the food. Um, I just cut my hair. I'm getting a little bit better. I need to work on my line a little bit better, but. Blending, I gotta work on a little bit more. But yeah, straight for right now. I'm about to go to the shop right now. And um, that painting with the twist event that I was telling you about, that Dory Stone, that's about to happen at six. No, no eight, but we're about to go down there right now and set up and make sure that everything looks good. Might get a little snap before I head out, but yeah. That's what I'm about to do now. Oh, dig. Yeah, I'm about to do that now. All right, so we're still setting up for dope paints, but yeah, we got some wine. Um, here you go, we got one section, the low, the low sitting section. Yeah, we got the three regular tables. Something happens, and the text on the 18 person, 30 person thread we have is like, so yeah, Jesse and uh, Dory are getting more supplies, and this is the painting that they'll be creating today. And that's a little overview. So yeah, this is the first out of many, hopefully. Hopefully it's a success. It's a success, but yeah, so far. Pero usted del gobierno canario. Y lo, y lo.